Hello viewers, so I hope you all are fine. So today I am coming with my old project, Digital Library System. So I received a lot of requests like, please help me out how to configure this project, each and everything. So I received almost more than 50 plus comments. So I decided to record one video from scratch, like how you guys can configure this project from my github to in your system i already recorded this video before but i think maybe you guys have issues so i decided to record a new one so first of all that's our project in which you guys can do a login system for admin and student so first of all please record the email ids and password for the student and the admin so for student login the email id is id number double two three eight two at the rate gmail.com and the password is one two three so here it is and if we talk about the admin so admin password is same the only difference is the gmail id so gmail id id number double two three eight one at the rate gmail.com and password is one two three so i already i already recorded a detailed video how my project works like how you are student how you request for a book how you issue book how you delete the records everything each and everything so this video is just about how you configure this project into your system so let's get started so that's the link you can find this link in this video description so currently i delete my project so i will do from scratch so what you guys have to do just download this zip file or if you want to clone you can use the command lines and download it go to the location i just do cut and go to your c drive then xam folder then docs, and just paste your project then unzip so that's our main folder so basically these are two images like how it works that's the old version like index page i change the colors but my still that project is still available on the github as well the old one so basically this is your sql file like your database first of all and you find one zip file just extract that zip file as well okay so that's our main project library underscore project so what you have to do just do cut just come back into sg docs and paste it here okay then go to your local host localhost php my admin make sure you guys turn on the xamp control so make sure your apache and mysql is in running mode so let's come back
okay so come to your localhost php my admin and create a new one and just drag and drop your sql file so i already have this one that's why it's not creating okay let's create a new one otherwise what you have to do just make sure the spelling of this just create a new one so i already have on this name so go to the import choose file of the sql as go when you select the choose file then press go so your database comes like this okay then what you have to do then type go to the chrome or any browser which you are using just press localhost slash the folder name so in our case our folder name is library underscore project so make sure the spellings so that's our project okay so let's talk about the errors i receive a lot of message like people are facing a problem led to the database error so make sure just open the, your project there's one file called db.php so make sure your database name is exactly same to this one so i have a wrong spelling of management i just do this one wrong because people don't do the exact observation they just try to copy paste the code so main thing you guys have to understand the concept like how it, this project will work so just copy this db name paste into this one when you are creating a new one so it's exactly same i know the management si spellings are wrong but still so i hope this video is enough for you i ans i try to answer all your queries but still if you find any confusion you guys can comment me or approach me on instagram i try to answer you guys as soon as possible i hope you guys understand nowadays i'm busy in my studies and other projects like my games project so soon i will come with my other playlist like how to make money with your own publications for the website and the game so see you guys soon with the new videos thank you for your support and your help take care of yourself bye